you for watching Gaming Theater Presents. I am your host, Geek Scorpio. Enjoy this program and sit back and relax. We find the group being woken up by Frog after a long rest. Awaketh, Crotto! Though we may fail, let us go to Mag Slayer. Uh, I had a wonderful dream, except you were there, and you were there, and you were there. Let's go. Thou knowest his power? No! He eats power tabs for breakfast. Nothing can beat science! We must do it to save our future. Well, it's your future, it's my present, but the, yeah. All right, Frog, but we've got to make a quick stop. Quickly, to the time vortex theme. I'm, I'm sorry, to the what? As the team once again returns to the time gate in Truce Canyon to head back to the end of time. Yeah, we'll do it. I'm gonna see. Hey, you know that? Are you? You're not gonna see. I got my own. You know, I can give you any man you want. My own way. You gave yourself an identity right shoulder. I don't doubt it. Why do we have well? Bring it up. Why don't we do the murder? You know what? Try to hop, hop, hop in the water. It will bow, mean it bow. Bow! Oh, can't use magic. I'll show you magic. Magic of punching. Lasers. Frog learned to use magic. I have no idea what this man has just said, and now I have magical powers. Am I a witch? You are a frog. No, 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 thank you. We're. Let's back away. After a quick change of characters and some debate, Luca joins the party once more. Wait, I, thought you, I thought you were bringing me! Oh. Hi, Luca and Frog! Hi. And Chrono! Mm. Oh, yeah, bye, Chrono! As the team travels through the Truce Canyon Gate, we find the group back at the Magic Cave in 600 A.D. What are you doing, Frog? It's just a rock. Thou! Be Cyrus! Run for thy lives! <laughs> Thanks, Sea <C> Dog. <laughs> Verily, Glenn. There are times when people simply have to grit their teeth. But dog, it hurts when I get hit, they... Thou art a marshmallow, Glenn.
Hark, Glenn. I've been thinking about becoming a knight. Sick dog. I knew you were going to enlist. You'll be totally righteous. Why doth thou not join as well? Bro, I... I don't think I cut it. I promise you won't be lit on fire or anything. But why? Thou art better with a sword than I. Oh, dog. Just... Will you think I'd lose my crap if I had to hurt somebody? Exclamation point! Bro! And a Thor, the mass of moon. Well, what do you think, Luca? Oh, honey, I think he's having a moment. You should give him that sword. Oh, okay. All right, just take it from the ground. It's heavy. My name is Glenn, Cyrus' hopes and dreams, and now the Masa Moon. Forthwith, I shall slay Magus and restore honor! Oh, that's not good. Tis fine, tis fine. Uh, uh, Luca? Oh, honey, I don't know. I have to take some samples. I'll get back to you in two to three weeks. Tis perfectly normal part of the process. Oh, this is some Moses shit. You know what? For safety reasons? We'll, we'll just give that. We'll just let Frog have that. By the by, <laughs> Sir Chrono, that is what a great swordsman can do. Mm, preach. Oh, get. you get. Oh, honey. And science. Power with the what in the who? What? That's anything. And God shall smite the wicked. What are powers? Activate. They're not as cool as lightning power. Yes, 
one of those boxes that plays crazy music. Uh, Chrono, what what art thou talking about? Oh, he just gets like this, honey. Just let him be. Blah! See? Blah! There's a vampire! Well, it's more of a vamp. See, it's only like half a vampire. Yes, it's it's a of the same. Give me back my blood! Oh, honey, you don't want your blood back like that, I can tell you. You have a grenade? Smith, did you have a grenade? I made it with science and the power of Jesus. Amen. Follow up may or may not have taken money from me again. Always with the face. Fight someone else! I hate to tell you this, Frog, but you are like 90% face there. Like, your head's bigger than most of your body. It's really weird. Why? Wow, that took a long time to do that. It was graceful and majestic. Personally, I don't have much time for grace or majesty, unless it is Jesus. Look, lightning from above. Think? That's what I'm doing. Lightning from above. I stopped asking questions a while ago. Someone needs to call an exterminator. I don't think they generally send exterminators to the wild. Well, they should, because clearly there is clientele out here. Yeah, that's a lot of little bugs, and at least two to three vampires. Or vamps. When they become full-blown vampires, then we'll consider sending the exterminator. Oh, honey, you should never wait for a problem to get serious before you address it. My uncle did that with his back problems and mm -mm. By the by, is anybody else alarmed by this bat following us? Yeah, you know, that that just occurred to me. It's kind of weird, right? Oh, thank God somebody else can see it. I thought I was going loopy with, like Kronos with his magic musical boxes. That's a serious thing. A note written in blood. The juggler in Magus' castle strengthens his guard when attacked. Beware. Man, I'm glad people leave these notes. Too bad they didn't read them for themselves. He may not have been killed by a juggler. Yeah. Uh, so where do you think Magus's castle is? Is it? Do you think it's the spooky spot here? Hmm. Go no, home. Go away. This can only be... Magus' castle. Man. Truly, he hath gone full, Edgelord. Oh, good. I thought it was one of them Catholic churches. Oh, uh, yeah, it's just... 
when did it become midnight? It's really dark, and that moon is huge. Tis always midnight here. All right, door's not spooky at all. Not scary. Bat's still following us. What dangers lie waiting in this castle for our heroes? Tune in next time to Gaming Theater Presents.